Well, we're at the Hinsdale Outdoors classroom, just in case you're wondering what the egg teacher's having to do, other than teach online classes. I am working on making sure there's still food here for when the kids are back in school come August. There's our tomato tunnel. These are American plums. Kids just love them. They're the highest amount of entertainment and and yummy food. I'm gonna put some potatoes in, garlic's in up over there. Let's go check out, see what's been happening here. Can still pass a solar greenhouse. Built by the ag students back in 2010-11. So, we've got winter peas up. Well, they're not winter peas, they're snap peas. But they're up and going fantastic. Got some cabbages there. And those aren't weeds underneath there. That's a sweet alyssum coming up. It's part of our farmscaping. Some more cabbages. Some onions that we'll just let go to flower so kids can see what that looks like. A lot of people don't know what the reproduction part of gardening or food is. These are the water barrels that heat this passive solar greenhouse. It's a zero energy bill. There's some of our young tomatoes. Sweden, uh, sweet alyssum, nasturtium, some more kale, broccoli. Some of our farmscaping sunflowers down there. And this is our wonder kale planted by the kidney gardeners last September. And here's its counterparts. Uh, the red Russian there made it, but the other varieties did not. But super cool and yummy, and now we know when we can plant it to uh, be able to harvest when we want to harvest. And those are cabbages in there as an undercrop to those kale, because we're going to take those kale out. Cabbage will be up and big and going by then. Here's some of our bedding starts tomatoes, cauliflower, broccoli. We try to shoot for stuff that the kids will eat and things that are super easy for the cooks to put on the salad bar. So that is our goal, is that the kids are growing and eating. So of course with this uh, predicament going on with all this homeschooling, I'm growing and they're going to eat. But they will be harvesting come August, September. Well, thanks for visiting Hinsdale Outdoor Classroom and see what we're doing in the Ag Ed Department.